A'udhu Billahi Min Shaitan Ar Rajeem, Bismillahir Rahmanir Raheem. The reminder from myself always, our way is based on how to destroy the ego and how to bring the power to the soul and they want different things. The conscious being from the soul and the ego being the nafs, anytime the nafs talks it's a defense of the self. This happened because of this fear, this happened. The nafs is always trying to defend. But the soul is happy with all sorts of difficulty. So the soul never defends something wrong that was done to you. The soul is happy with that, it says, you deserved it and that you should be crushed for Allah's sake. And the nafs says, no, 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 I have to take retribution. The nafs is always in a state of defending the body and the soul is very content in crushing the body. And inspiration of the nafs is to defend the body, so I, let me be inspired to go tell him he's wrong. It's from the nafs. The soul's inspiration is, I should pray about 50 rakahs right now as a tawbah. And those are the hardest to follow. The soul's inspiration is for worshipness. When you feel that you're being inspired by your soul, say, what is the inspiration of the soul? It's for worshipness. I should do now 20,000 salawats and I shouldn't move until that's finished. I should do 10,000 istighfars, I should pray 20 rakahs in my salah. Those inspirations come and people brush that away really quick and say, oh no, no, I don't feel like that. But the nafsani one is all based on the self and glorify the self and vindicate the self. And that's what we said, Western words is, is based on completely egoistic understandings which we would never use those words from Sufi training. Self-realization, that's like saying ego realization, self-help, ego help. You don't want help from your ego and, and you don't want the, the ego to help you in your realization. So this play on words are very dangerous. So our way is, is based on how to destroy the ego and how to bring the power to the soul and they both, they want different things. When Allah want to open these senses there are going to be many physical effects. They're going to feel different energies entering into their ears. They're going to feel different subtleties upon their hand, upon their feet. Because you become latif, you become more subtle. When you focus on these senses and you focus on these body parts means that it become more sensitive to the energy and to the vibration. When Allah want to open its sensitivity means your focus is on your ears and you're trying to live a life of samina wa atana, you become very sensitive to hearing. You hear things, you, you, you feel vibrations, you have a depth and understanding of sound and, and salawats and all of these realities, the more you're focusing on hearing, the more sensitive you become and more attuned to it. And also with sound, loud sounds and, and agitations and vibrations, anything that you focus in will become much more sensitive under the different uh, characteristics of subtlety from Sifat al
Welcome to Century 21 AAA Realty. We specialize in commercial and residential properties, including all your financing needs. We are one-stop shop under one roof. Owning a home is a keystone of wealth, both financial and emotional. Don't wait for opportunity. Create it. Come meet our award-winning realtors with over 40 years of experience. Call Century 21 AAA Realty. Knowledge, quality, integrity. Star cares about your best interests and have a wealth of experience to match. We've been in the business 30 years and are here to lead you every step of the way. Whether it's building the custom home of your dreams, doing gorgeous home renovations, building a laneway home, or revamping your commercial space. The star process works. Just ask our hundreds of satisfied customers. We have several properties and the best thing about Star for Life Services is that the work is done in a very timely manner and we're always very pleased with the result. Star, let's make your dreams happen. Call us now to book your free consultation. Nas Window Blinds offers high quality custom window coverings for both residential and commercial projects. We offer a stunning range of colors and design options. We also provide an on-site measurement and style consultation so that you can be sure you're getting the very best option for your windows. Let us enrich the look, feel and value of your space with custom window coverings. Call Nas Blinds today. So you have muhabbat of shaykh, the love of the shaykhs, the guides. That love makes us to come to the association. The hudur means to keep his presence. I love to be in the presence but I have to be in the presence all the time. If I'm not in the presence I'm under attack and under difficulty and that's when Allah kunu ma sadiqeen. He didn't say, Kunu ma sadiqeen only in the daytime, Kunu ma sadiqeen only fajr. No, Allah's order is keep the company of sadiqeen. Allah's words are eternal and have no time. And more important, it's not even from the mulk, it's from Malkut Allah's keeping. That keep their company, reach to that reality and never split from that moment, never to be on your own. As soon as you stray, shaitan will grab you. So why would anyone want to be away from their madad and their support? And Allah just said, hold tight to the rope. Not in the daytime and at nighttime you don't have to hold or only on Jummah you hold to the rope. The only because everyone now only goes for Jummah, the rest of Islam they don't have any understanding. So no, no, this is a, a practice that you do all day and night, day and night. When they're going to do the meditation, I'm nothing, I'm nothing, let me to be in the presence of my shaykh, said he dress me with your nazar. With your heart's faith, do you see the, the presence of your shaykh? It's like right now you're looking at him, close your eyes and visualize he's right there. So anyone looking, you just close your eyes, can't you see the same image in your heart's eye? And you keep that image, keep that image that the shaykh is right there. 
Say that just dress me from your nazar and then you may if you're going to be doing your awrad, you do your awrad. Ashhadu an la ilaha illa Allah, Muhammad Rasulullah, Ashhadu an la ilaha illa Allah, Ashhadu an keep your nazar upon me. So then they do their awrad with full tafakkur. So that it's the tafakkur that begin to open these fires and these energies. Then if I have to do my Allah or my salawats then I can do my zikr of Allah because this is the source of power, the, the tafakkur is the source of power. Want to be nothing, if you're nothing that's how to open the fires of the shaykhs. And that the tarbiyah of the shaykhs, that they're going to have their nazar upon you and begin the tarbiyah process, begin to send unto your consciousness what you're doing wrong, begin to send unto you lights and energies. Only through that dimension everything opens, that's the real opening, that's the real door when Allah say, go through the home, through the proper opening. Proper open, opening is malakut in the soul, not mulk, Allah didn't care for the mulk. So when you enter through the soul that's the relationship that Allah wants. So they do their zikr, they, they do their salawats. When they're sitting and asking for the salawats, Allah said, Muhammad Muhammad said, dress me from your life, put your faiz upon me that I'm nothing. Later in their tafakkur they'll be trained in their tafakkur that say that there can't be two, there can only be one. That I'm seeing you but I don't want to exist, I don't want to exist, put your light and your dress upon me. Those who rise to that level of understanding they negated themselves and they brought the dress of their shaykh upon themselves and they sit and they do their salawats, Allahumma say, Subhanahu wa ta'ala, in that, in that state. That they acknowledge that they're nothing, if they're nothing then they're in the dress of the shaykh. The dress dresses over them and they find themselves like a piece of dust within his reality and they're making their zikr and their salawat, their zikr, their salawat. Later when they want to bring the power of their breath they can do their breathing. They can do the zikr of who? And then each faculty is something different. That would be the meditation on the breath and how to do the meditation of the breath. Subhana wa bika rabbal izzata ma yasitoon wa salaamun al mursaleen Alhamdulillahi rabbal alamin wa hurmati Muhammad wa mustafaq wa bi siri surah al fatiha Are you ever searching for what zikr to recite for a particular situation or which prayer to make for an event or need? The search is over. We bring to you through the Muhammadan Way app, an all-encompassing Islamic guide. A platform where you can find all the surahs from Holy Quran, special du'as and prayers, as well as live zikrs and comprehensive Islamic teachings from world-renowned scholars. Download this powerful app now and keep up to date with in-app notifications. Available for download on iOS and Android. The annual Grand Milad brought to you by Hubi Rasul is taking place on November 8th at 6 p.m. Come celebrate the biggest mawlid on the west coast and raise the flags of love for this most blessed occasion. Take part in Salawat, Nat and Kavali recitations. 
ziyara of the holy hair of Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him. Also, enjoy a delicious three-course meal, all included in this free event. Tickets are available now on nurmuhammad.com forward slash events.